You know, if you take a picture of the fire, you can see faces in the coals. Oh, really? Yeah, it's like a macabre painting of hell. Like tortured souls. That sounds cool. Do you have your phone? Nope. Do you? No. Damn. I could stare into a fire for hours. It's kind of like the original television, if you think about it. You know, it's actually been proven that staring at a fire lowers your blood pressure, promotes relaxation, and pro-social behaviors. That's interesting. I didn't know that. Hey, I I know you've been dealing with a lot lately, and I just want you to know that I'm here for you if you need anything. Yeah, I know, it's just that I feel like my shit's a burden sometimes. Never. You're never a burden to me. After I lost my dad, I was so confused, you know? Like, you just, you never think something like that's gonna happen to you. Even though death is the only thing in this world that's promised to us, you feel safe from it somehow. <laughs> Until it happens. And then someone you love is just gone forever and then the sadness hits and the confusion's gone and you know no no one really understands the weight of it unless they've experienced it you know Sorry. I know. Thank you. I know you've probably heard this a million times by now, but I'm here if you need anything at all. I'm just, I feel numb now. And it scares me. Like there's an elephant sitting on me. But from the inside. And I just wish that I could crack open my chest and pull this feeling out. I know that our situations are very different right now, but I think I understand. I find myself disassociating a lot lately. It's like I'm living my life behind my eyes, like I'm not even in myself. And it scares me too. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry I don't have any like, advice for you or anything. Yeah, me too. But you being here with me is enough. Maybe this is just what getting old is. Right? I mean, 
my parents were married and having a baby at my age. Like, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I don't know anything. I mean, does anybody? Everyone's just pretending that everything is fine all the time and we're just all suffering and lying to each other. And I just don't get it. Yeah, you're absolutely right. I mean, it feels like we were set up for these impossible expectations and all I want to do is just be happy, you know? Yeah. Want a s'more?